artist's perspective and the power of your imagination. So many perspectives when we speak the word artist or artist, artiste. A lot of people still misunderstood the word. It's not because you are, you are creating or producing or called a great artist. Over the years, I'm trying to perfect my skills in the world of art because I know art and its history changes. It changes that even the way we see art evolve because of time. But the word itself has so much meaning in life. It comes with emotions, the thoughts, the process, and the process to evolve. It's a learning curve aligned to your own perceptions of imaginations and requires countless of intellectual thinking. I like to say that this world is but a canvas to our imagination. An imagination is that you yourself can feel and see it. And as an artist, it's, it's up to us to maneuver which directions you want to pursue in life. So believe me when I say creativity does not come from nowhere. It comes from within your soul. It's like a fire that ignites your senses. It is an instinct. It is not made on the spot because you are creating. It comes with patience, time and error to learn from your own mistakes. We have bad days and this moment is the best time to pour out your actions that can turn into creations. A creations of your feeling and moments. So the next time you feel unmotivated, use this time to create. In fact, as an artist, you are the only one who can intellectually think of this because this is how the process works. I am a thinker and a solver. I like to have a me time to myself. Don't blame me, this is how my nature works. I guess you can call it an introvert. An introvert in a good way. With so many lines, angles, shapes, sizes, movements that I see, even if I close my eyes, my eyes have been trained to observe, looked, and my body to speak, and my ears to listen on a progressive rhythm. A natural definition of an artist. I look at it as a gift, um, and this gift must be nurtured so you can hone your skills to whatever things you want to create or pursue with care. But sadly, with the evolutions of arts throughout the years, many have stopped creating due to the fact that they cannot adapt to the new norm or say, difficulty in settling in the scene. This is why being an artist is an ongoing target. The solution is upskill yourself. I have been into the situations and I'm not going to lie about this. Been there, done that. So the moral lessons really is to find your way out the crowds and continue to nurture your skills no matter the scale is big or small. There is always plenty of things to do.
express yourself no matter what you are or no matter what you feel like expressing but not for art's sake somehow my inspirations from one of the famous painters that gives great meaning to art is if you hear a voice within you say you cannot paint then by all means paint and that voice will be silenced so create write have a moment of yourself, dance, and express yourself. Are you an artist? What are you waiting for? So be inspired. And every child is an artist. The problem is how to remain an artist once we grow up. <laughs>